Joel Cheeseman here. I'm going to do a little hot seat uh, interview with him. Joel, welcome to the Recruiting Fly hot seat. I'm excited about the hot seat. All right, let's begin. Uh, what do you think of the future of Jobster uh, without Jason Goldberg? Well, it certainly won't be as exciting, I would imagine. Um, but I don't know. You know they, I don't know who they're bringing in. Um, you know, they, they certainly have a brand in terms of recognition. They have, I assume, you know, a decent amount of traffic. They have data in the, in the um, sense of users. I assume they have a good amount of employers in their database. So I certainly wouldn't wouldn't count them out or say that they're on the, uh, the quick road to uh, oblivion. But um, I think it's just a wait and see situation. All right, very good. Uh, Monster is one of your favorite topics, so uh, they seem a bit lost lately. We're Will in they... their uh, name badge today. That's right. Will they ever uh, find their way home? Will they ever find their way home? Yes. I'm not sure what that means. Well, I mean, they've uh, kind of stumbled a bit this year with a lot of problems. Yeah, and, you know, I uh, think, um, you know, talk is cheap. And, uh, you know, we've most, most of us heard the... Uh, uh, the conference call they had about three months ago, and they said they were going to be more user-centric and take away some of the spammy uh, things like the, uh, you know, the interstitial ads and whatnot, and to date they really haven't done that. So where they're, they're talking, I think they're, they're saying the right things. They're certainly not, not doing the right things, um, and I'd certainly like to see them do some of these uh, that they're talking about. I, and, I, and I do think that, um, from what I understand, there's a, a task force that's in charge of, like, building bridges with people like me and the community and trying to figure out how they can be become a more friendly company. So that's, I haven't heard much about that except just in Have they kind of whispers. Um, uh, um, Neil Bruce asked to sit down with me today uh, for, or during the conference for 30, 30 minutes to an hour. So my assumption is he may want to talk about some things of how Monster can improve their their reputation with, with people like me or just the blogosphere or whatever. So, you know, that you know that could be a good blogging topic on Cheesehead, so I'd, I'd tune into that and see if uh, there's any good good content that I can provide. Okay, we shall. Uh, SEO. Will, uh, will SEO ever become a primary recruiting tool? Take your time. A primary recruiting tool? I mean, probably not. I think that the, the way of the world today is that you have a, a toolbox and you have a myriad of tools it's not 20 years ago where you had the newspaper and that was it. And it's not even 10 years ago where you had the newspaper and, and a few job boards. I mean, you have everything from now social networking to um, SEO, search engine marketing. Um, Facebook is, you know, has an ad platform. Um, I just heard about a, a company the other day that's spending over a million dollars on Facebook uh, to market their employment opportunities. So. Will it be a primary? You know, I don't think so, but I don't think anything will be a primary. I think that, that a recruiting strategy will be um, a variety of, of things that work best for the, uh, the culture of the uh, employer. Okay. Uh, video resumes, are you friend or foe? I think the jury's still out. Um, as much as I would like to think that it's the wave of the future and so many of my bloggerati brother, uh, brethren believe that it is, it's... Um, you know, uh, Kevin Wheeler at a conference, uh, you know, prominent blogger and, and consultant in the space, Kevin Wheeler asked, how many employers would sit through two to three minute video resumes uh, in their recruitment efforts? And nobody raised their hand. Now, that doesn't mean that when someone's further along in the process that video wouldn't.